Let's take a look at the Kimber Warriors. They come in hard cases like this. Let's open it up. This is the 08. The 08 is slightly shorter than the other ones in the range. There's four in total in the range. This one's slightly shorter so it recycles faster. These are direct clones from the TM handgun. The difference between these and the TMs, these are solid metal construction and not plastic. Has a slide stay, hammer, full safety guard at the back and full safety switch. Great magazine, good quality gas mag. Got great weight to them, they feel really heavy. They come apart really easy for maintenance. First take the mag out, then simply slide, slide back, hold it in position, take this pin out, slide, slide forward. As you can see, the construction is very, very good. Slide it back on. Line it back up. Drop the pin in. Magazine back in. So once again, this is the Zero 08. Fantastic gun. Let's take it to the range. Here we are at the range. This is next to our shop. Let's fire these Kimbers, show you what they can do. Once you've taken your magazine out of the gun, simply get your gas. There's lots of different gas on the market. I quite like the kick-ass gas, but any good quality green gas will do the job. Simply turn your magazine upside down, must be upside down. Turn your gas canister upside down and push down a couple of times. You'll hear it go in. Just do a few of those. Very good quality mags. You can hear there's no leakage at all. There's no gas escaping. Very good quality. Let's just purge it. Show you that again. Now, don't ever leave your mag with no gas in it at all. It has special oil in it that keeps all the seals lubricated. So always leave a little bit of gas in the gun when you've finished. One full mag of this gas will do you about one and a half to two magazines of ammo. If you don't have a speed loader, get yourself a speed loader. Go on the website, just simply open the top, pour the ammo in. You can pour them in like this. It's a bit slow for me. Basically, take the lid off. Up your hand over the top and just pour them in. Close the lid and then basically what happens is when you push the plunger down they come out the bottom. So with your Kimber gas magazine pull this down here this is the spring just pull that down hold it down you'll see that it goes wider just at the bottom here. So again holding it upside down with your speed loader there we can see that. Yeah. Very simple to fill. Now you can see there's lots of gaps. It's quite a good idea to get rid of those gaps. Once the magazine's full of gas and ammo, slide it into the gun. Set the gun once, and we're ready to fire. Once the ammo is finished, slide stay stays open. Release the mag, release the slide stay, and the trigger. So 
there's the four Kimber Warriors from Just BB Guns. Doesn't matter which one you choose, they're all very, very good clones of the TM. Gonna finish off telling you about Black Guns. These guns can be sold to anybody that has a Yukara membership. Can also be sold to anybody that has an existing current site, skirmish site membership. These can be sold to you. If you haven't got one of those, then we can paint it for you. Painting is just 10 pounds. Let me show you some painted guns. This is a blue Kimber Warrior. This has been painted by our paint shop. This is in orange, painted in orange. Again, the mag, looks pretty cool. This one in green, again, exactly the same format. Slide and bottom of the mag, really good. So don't forget, Black Guns, Yukara members, or Skirmish Site members, painted otherwise, 10 pound extra, and you can get exactly the same guns. Ladies and gentlemen, we interrupt this program to bring you important news.